All right, folks, we have here a beautiful Jazzy 1103 Ultra. This is an oldie but goodie. This power chair has one mile. This is a very nice power chair. This power chair has a five inch seat lift, okay? So this is the smallest power chair out there you're gonna have for inside of a house with a five inch seat lift. As I said, this chair has one hour, so someone got this chair several years ago and it just sat in the house. As you can see, it's still brand new. Um, so it's, this is called the Jazzy 1103 Ultra with the five inch seat lift, one hour on it. So to make the seat go up, what you do to make the seat go up, you just, there's a button on here and it's got a picture of a seat. You push that button and then you use your joystick forward to make the seat go up. And here's your seat going up right now. And that's the normal noise for the seat. And when you're all the way to the top, you're going to be roughly at 27, 28 inches because you're going to start roughly at 20, 21. I'm sorry. Let me rephrase that. You're going to start roughly at 20, 21. And you're going to add five inches. So you'll be roughly 25, 26 inches, okay, to the top of the seat. Uh, the chair will drive with the seat. The chair will drive with the seat elevated, but it'll drive at a lower speed, much lower speed, okay? So it doesn't drive really fast with the seat elevated. One more thing too, the seat has to be all the way down to get your full speed back. Now this chair will go four or five miles an hour, but the seat has to be all the way back down. There's a sensor in there and it has to be down. So let's look at the front of this chair, the side of it. As you can see, it's black in color. We have 10 inch solid wheels. We have caster wheels in the back and you have tip wheels in front. This chair has got what's called active track suspension. What that means is your front tip wheels are tied to your motors. So if I lift this wheel right here, you can see the motor back there. There's a spring here and it's called active track suspension. Okay. You have a motor for each wheel has an independent motor. Okay. If I want to push this chair, I can't push it right now because it's in gear. But if I turn the power off, and right on top of the motor right here, you can't see it from there, but I'll pull it out. There's a handle right here. When you pull that handle out, you can see it right there. That puts the chair in neutral. You have to do both motors, then you can roll your chair around. But don't forget, when you're done, put it back in gear, then turn your power back on. The chair has a built-in charger. So I don't know if this chair's ever charged. It will have new batteries when you get it, so don't worry about that. But it has a built-in charger right here, okay? And usually we leave the cord inside the charger like this, and we leave the cord in the back pouch. So all you have to do when you're done at the end of the day is plug the cord into the wall. Now we've had some people run the cord all the way to the front of their joystick so they can get to the cord easier. So you can also do that. But the cord is right here in the back pouch. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring the seat back down. So the seat is coming down. And here's another thing that's nice about this chair. This, well just wait till it's all the way down here. This chair has one of the nicest seat that's ever been built by Pride Mobility. This is the old style seat. It's just super comfortable, very high quality seat. This is a captain's seat. So what a captain's seat is, you would have a headrest, a high back, and you have a lever where you can fold the seat down. Your top high point right here would be about 33, 34 inches right here, okay? And if you recline it all the way back, this is as far as it would go. And if your dri driving position would be about here. The arms do flip up and they also, well, let me do it this way. The arms flip up and they also go out and they also go up, they're adjustable. You have a safety belt. The seat on this chair is 20 wide by 19 deep. So this is a really, really nice seat, high quality seat. You have on this chair the extra large foot plate, which is a little bit longer than most of them. And when you flip the foot plate up and you exit, there's nothing in front right here, okay? Here is your reset button. If you ever had to reset the power, that's your reset button right there. Um, so let's look at the chair when it turns in a circle so you can see how well it turns. This is the smallest chair you can get with a five inch seat lift. So you can see it turns pretty much on its own length. So if I go in a circle again, you'll see. It turned pretty much on its own length. 
So if you need a small power chair with a seat lift, this is called the Jazzy 1103 Ultra Power Chair. Practically brand new, it has one mile. It has the five inch seat lift, the solid 10 inch tires, the extra large foot plate, the high quality captain seat with the safety belt, active track suspension, just a beautiful power chair. If you need something really basic, but with a small power chair with a seat lift, with a high quality seat, this is the one to look at. So this is the Jazzy 1103 Ultra Power Chair. Top speed is four and a half, five miles an hour. It's very easy to drive. It turns real nice. Very, I can't even hear the motor, it's so quiet. So you can see this is a pretty easy chair. I mean, this, I went in the grass here, but my grass is uh, pretty nice. So it's, I'm not saying it's a yard chair, but it's definitely an inside chair if you need something small and you need something with a five inch seat lift. There goes the seat lift right now. I'm, I'm raising the seat as I'm talking. As I said, it'll drive with the seat elevated, but it'll be at a lower speed. This is what it looks like with a seat elevated. So if you're looking for a nice chair, practically brand new at one mile, this is a really nice one. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.